I want to bring to your attention a very nice lab that I finished running, uh, created by my friend uh, Vladimir Jeremik. And this is a great way of actually getting familiar with UBA, the latest version of it, as well as Watson and how the two of them works together. It's pretty unique in that sense. Uh, you can run this lab in two ways. One is you can click here and because this is the Security Learning Academy, you have a remote system in which you have everything installed and you are good to go. You don't need to install anything. The, the VM is, is there for you. And then you follow this lab guide, which is in la, uh, online, in which you g go to the steps and you actually uh, learn quite a bit uh, from, from this, I'm sure. Uh, but also, and notice that there are some supporting materials in case uh, for some UBA scripts and LDAP. And what this is all about is that my friend Vladimir also created, created this UBA lab setup for you to install that environment in your Curator CE. So you install Curator CE and I'll put some links to everything in here in the video description. Uh, but this shows you the steps that you will need to do to get this lab, not remotely on the Security Learning Academy, but rather in your uh, local CE. So you can play with it and learn more about uh, Curator. All the steps are nicely uh, documented in here. I follow them and had uh, no problem reproducing that, that uh, environment. Now, let me show you what I ended up been having. So here's uh, my uh, UBA, the, you know, with, with all those users. Medicoy is the, the user I was uh, actually investigating. And you have the uh, link uh, to Watson in here. Again, I'm, all this is very nicely detailed in the lab guide. And I'm, as again, I'm running this in my Curator CE. And I did some uh, uh, investigation of some of the events, and you get very nice graphic with local content, those green lines and all that explained there. They graze the stuff that you uh, send to Curator. And in blue is the actual uh, findings that Curator did. And all this is uh, actually on the latest version of, uh, of uh, uh, the Watson advisor with the mitered attack. So you can actually see, you know, what's, what's the piece of this, of, uh, of this attack that was the command and control mm -hmm. is actually this particular step when it went there and you know what what are the execution steps you know it went this way so again it's a new UI for both uh, the latest version of UBA as well as Watson and it's a nice uh, example of how to play with the two of them and it's a great opportunity for you when you go into the lab guide that that uh, Blood did. You are going to be performing a bunch of steps uh, that I'm. I, I I consider very useful for you to learn more about the ins and out of Curator. Uh, again, you can go by simply, you know, going for the ride, taking a nice ride here by the security lab, or you can open the hood and understand how the mechanics of this work by uh, creating that particular lab setup on your Curator CE version. Uh, hope you enjoy it. Uh, again, there is also the links for these, because before I forget, for all these are going to be in the video description, as well as a box link in which you, there are some additional files that you will need from them. Uh, from there, you're going to get those files from, from it. But please go into the, into the Learning Academy and log in if you don't have an account or registered for it. Uh, and download this file from there so my friend Vladimir gets credit uh, for the good work he did in here.